Hey Esther, um, thanks for your questions. I want to do my best to give you some answers in this video. So the first one you have is about blogging. So you're doing the daily roundup of the uh, the news in the country music scene, which is great stuff. Um, so I guess you're asking, should you uh, split? You know, should you do a, a big post and maybe the ten top stories in country music, or would it be better for SEO purposes to, uh, for instance? do a story that was buzzing within country music. Now, both of those strategies are valid as well. So, you know, if, if there's a new album coming out or something like that, it can be useful and valuable to do one single post on your blog about that album so that you start to pick up the search engine traffic and stuff like that. But the idea of the daily roundup specifically is twofold. The first thing is obviously to uh, be a service to your fans. So if they have to go to lots of different pages on your site and stuff like that, um, from my point of view personally, I don't think that's as valuable as if they could go there, go to one single page and actually get all those stories um, you know, and, and to read them all in one place. So for the purposes of the daily roundup and um, you know, give, doing a service for your fans, I'd say that one page um, is a better option, but it's good to keep in mind the SEO stuff as well. So if, if you, know, you want to maybe focus out on one um, story per week that's a particularly big story that you want to try and pick up some traffic for, then you can break it out and do a, a longer post about that if you want to as well. But the other thing with a single post is that you've got to create a lot more content, so it's not as quick as just doing a quick daily roundup. So I hope that kind of answers your question, but it's good to be thinking about the um, the search engine optimization stuff. And also, even though, um, even though you're not specifically doing a post about uh, the topic, um, you could still be picked up in the search engines because you're actually mentioning uh, the news story in your daily roundup post. So I would suggest if you're going for the daily roundup thing uh, to break it into, um, you know, to, to do it as one single post. And then you can even email that out to your mailing list as well. You could do a, a weekly thing and stuff like that. Um, for the Facebook stuff, the Facebook question is how many posts ideally to Facebook per day? Um, this is kind of up to you. There's no hard and fast rule here. I like to kind of see at least two posts to Facebook a day, um, you know, with some of your own content, with some stuff that's going on, you know, maybe asking people questions, engaging people and stuff like that. Um, and you ask about engaging and growing your Facebook page and actively and like actively building some likes. So um, one tip for actively building some likes, um, and I kind of, I posted it to the blog the other day, so we might be able to go over and have a look at that. Um, or you know at least to give you an idea of the strategy um, one thing that you can do is actually create some like fan only content um, and then ask people to like it in exchange uh, for getting it so I know that sounds I'm kind of like sort of babbling slightly there but what I mean is that um, the way I posted it to this blog so it's like how to hack um, years of the music marketing and hustle and this talks about uh, doing rapid fan formula um, but doing it with a free gift rather than um, giving people a commission because some people you know some people aren't as into commission they just want to give their people kind of cool free stuff so uh, what I show in this particular post is a way that you can set up Facebook um, down here you can set up Facebook so that people who come to your page if they've liked your Facebook page already then they're gonna get the content and if they haven't then it's gonna ask for the it's gonna ask them to like your page to access it so to answer your question how can you build uh, likes on Facebook um, that is how you can do it so you want to create some fan only content maybe create a special song or a special post or give people a sneak peek of a blog post that you're coming up and you know, say to your email list, you know, go over to this page, like the page to get access to it. So you're actively sending people from your email list over to like your Facebook page as well. So that is one way you can start to actively build up your Facebook uh, likes. So hopefully that rambling um, explanation kind of uh, kind of gives you a tip. So just go over to that post and you'll see exactly how to do that. And the final question you've got for me is how many tweets um, per account you know per day should you send to your account or how many tweets should you automate and again this depends on how much time you're gonna um, you're gonna devote to creating or, or looking for content that you can post out to your people um, if I find a cool story or if I have a blog post that I want to tweet out to people one thing I'll do is like I'll post it or I'll automate it I'll automate it to go out one one time um, th that day then I'll, I'll automate it to go out you know in maybe four days time and then I'll automate it to go out you know in a month's time and and again in you know maybe six months time so um, 
that kind of uh, that makes that time that you put into actually setting up or finding that tweet it sort of uh, it has more impact on the time you spent to do that um, at the very least I'd say you want to have five tweets per day because you want to be covering people as they spend time on Twitter so people spend time on Twitter all different times so you want to have a tweet in the morning a tweet at lunchtime you know a tweet in the evening a tweet really early in the morning for people in other countries and stuff like that um, and obviously you know a later run for people in the States so hopefully that answers your questions um, if you've got any more at all just let me know and uh, yeah I'll speak to you soon